tens of thousands of people are pouring into the Mobile World Congress. The tight security can mean long lines and multiple ID checks, but some are allowed to walk right in just by flashing a smile. That's it. That was nice. They've opted into a facial recognition program developed by Canadian startup Mexio One. A few weeks before a conference like this one, you register and submit a photo. Then the artificial intelligence analyzes 158 points like bone structure, skin tone, your iris, and the space between your eyes. People are going through our lines and they're high-fiving high our operators because they're so happy how fast they're going through. He says the technology is nearly ready for prime time, stadiums and shopping malls. There's even talk of bringing facial recognition to the London too. And soon it may be coming to an airport security line near you. Eventually, I see that as being in three, maybe five years, that will become the seamless traveler experience where you will not have to stop at all of those checkpoints. So I've been standing here watching people come through the lines and I thought it was going to be the people using facial recognition that might be frustrated. I'm actually seeing more issues with people using the badges, having to scan them over and over again, and they're the ones who look more flustered. Biometrics, including facial recognition, are now a billion dollar industry. For companies like consulting giant PwC, there's big money to be made. There's a lot of information that can be monitored based on the patterns or the behaviors of the people that can be identified to facial recognition. But we know that the potential is going to be enormous. The potential may be huge, but privacy is still a major concern. Mexio One says it will destroy the attendee photos after the conference. What we're not doing is maintaining a facial image of people that we're then comparing against the database of other things. But legally, there's nothing stopping your biometrics obtained through facial recognition software from being sent to law enforcement or hungry advertisers. Samuel Burke, CNN, Barcelona.